Hey, welcome to my channel. I am Holly Hughes. I am a TEDx speaker and an award-winning author and an intuitive energy healer, which means that I can see, feel, and hear things, even taste things that other people can't. Or I like to say I can feel the spiritual reasons behind some of the feelings that you have or some of the pain and help you heal them. So today, I would like to discuss the difference between um, anxiety and receiving a message from a guide. Um, I really like to break it down to the simplest of terms. When you have anxiety, it causes fear, stress, makes you lose sleep, um, you get stuck in worry, you feel out of control, um, sometimes you feel helpless, definitely feel overwhelmed, and those are nothing at all. And those are not emotions that you connect to higher vibration healing, right? Like even when I say that out loud, that's gotta make sense to you, right? Anxiety is not a message from your guides. Messages from guides come from a high vibration, especially when you're grounded and rooted and you're asking for healing or insight. There are for sure dark energies or low vibration things out there. So please be cautious of that if you're new. Um, and trying to ground and receive messages from your guides on your own. Um, but what I know for 100% sure for me is I only connect with high vibration, 100% loving energies, ent entities, spirit guides, and archangels. So um, I get anxious sometimes. You know, I'm only human. I am real, not perfect, right? There's the title of my book behind me. On sale now and always. Um, and if you are a KDP, Amazon reader, it's free. You can just read it on your Kindle. Um, anyway, anxiety versus a message. A message comes with love. It comes with, I wanna protect you, I'm gonna guide you, I'm gonna help make this situation easier. Um, and so you'll get insight or you might even get a feeling of, I shouldn't drive down that road today or I shouldn't do that. And when you don't listen to that instinct, something happens, right? Something annoying or slows you up. Um, maybe you get in the wrong line um, at the grocery store. That's a very um, silly or kind of funny way to think about it, of getting a message, but I bet it's happened. If those kind of messages you've received, if you've gotten those and didn't listen or did listen, can you put that in the comments? I'd, I'd love to know more about like where you are on your spiritual journey and why you turn to energy healers. When I'm helping people deal with anxiety, I like to give the anxiety a color um, or a description. A lot of time anxiety looks like black scribble to me, like black Sharpie scribble. And um, I can connect with, right, your guides and my guides and help push that anxiety away, erase it, make it smaller, make it manageable, make it so it doesn't overwhelm you. A, a very easy visual. Again, if we make anxiety like scribble all around you, imagine that like that, like noise around you. And what I could do is slow it down, condense it, you can even make it a ball, and then hand it up to your angels and guides and like move it someplace else and have them take it away for you. If you're really good at grounding in nature, you can take that same energy and give it to the earth and ask the earth to take it away. And that way you make more room for love and light and compassion. So let me know, do you have a question about the difference now between anxiety and receiving a high vibration spirit and healing message? Let me know. Please like and follow, tag a friend if you think they need this help. Have a great day.